easy R RBG win. I always want to say RGB. But, but oh, whatever. Talent's right here. I'll slow you. Probably still gonna grab it. Grab the buff warrior. Thank God. Thank God. Mission accomplished. What would we have done if we didn't grab Berserking? Live. Very nice. I'm gonna bloodlust this guy. Then I think we're just gonna run in. Hide this. Don't really need to see this. Okay. Bloodlust. Come on. More damn, more damn. Go on the healer. Have chain harvest. Interrupted nothing. Feels good. Well, we used chain harvest, guys. I mean, we did that, right? Let's go on the warrior now. Ah, oh, those, <laughs> those storm strikes. They have two pallies using Ash and Hollow. Can't say I blame them. Kind of broken. But, God, this does not feel like an R RPG. I, I can already tell. I'm going to say RGB so many times. Urge this guy so we can interrupt him. Throw grounding down so the mage can't really do good damage to me. Urge bop. There we are. And we kill him with frost shock. All right, all right. Let's get objectives. A rehoard. E R. Okay. I guess I'll touch an objective if it's uh for for the the R B G. Slow this guy. You think I care? I'll still attack you even though I have the orb. I don't know. I really like avoiding orbs since more or less getting an orb guarantees your death. Well, I like avoiding them, but. I don't know, if, if it's for the conquest and it's for the a thousand, literal a thousand honor you get just for winning one RBG, then it's worth it, man. It's worth it. God, this team. I want to use Bloodlust when the Warriors are around, because, like, this Warrior's just super geared. And that 20% haste probably buffs his damage to, like, a stupid amount. There he is. Let's use Astral Shift here. Ground anything if we can. Probably won't ground anything. We'll use Shane Harvest just just because we'll hit for 20,000 with it, you know? Nothing to see here, I'm sure. Probably done. Oh, my Wind Fury's not working. I fucking hate it, dude. The fact Wind Fury doesn't work unless you reapply it every time you instance just makes me so sad. I was wondering why my damage too great. Gotta love having to reapply it. I don't like we're three months into the fucking expansion, man. It's, it's like the easiest fix to it. We'll just not touch an orb ever again. This is what I get, man. I play the objective, and then I realize that all along... Aren't you a healer? I'm so confused. <laughs> okay. Okay, man. Well, then, you know, that did hit for, you know, like, all of his health, so... I guess I really shouldn't be complaining. We'll give this guy bloodlust, ground, cooldowns. Heal me, healer. Chain harvest. That's oh, a lot more damage with Wind Fury, yeah? Feels good, feels good. Did 140k damage there. What What even is it, man? Let's go on the Hunter here. Slow him. Oh, Master's Call. Probably should have purged that. You reflected my Chain Lightning. What a champ. I'm gonna slow this guy again. I'm gonna really emphasize that on tanks, I purposely use my Maelstrom stacks just because tanks take increased magic damage. I think it's worth it in this situation. Because I'll just hit 11k lightning bolts like that every now and then. It kind of makes up for it. And we'll know we have the win guaranteed when they start leaving. This is what it takes to gear my characters now. I honestly just play RB RBGs. It's not too bad. Like item level wise. And just, you know, point wise. I mean a thousand conquest. Sorry, not a thousand conquest. That'd be stupid. Thousand honor, you get like a hundred, I believe, conquest, which is pretty good to be honest. Especially if you don't like doing uh arenas too. 
Goodbye, warrior. Oh, you poor soul. Give me those Wind Fury procs, though. Literally trinketed just so I could hit him with Wind Fury. Just like normal auto attack Wind Fury hits. Come here, Death Knight. See who wins. Spirit Shift, Astral Shift, whatever. We'll, we'll use Chain Harvest. I don't feel like dying. Not gonna grab the orb, of course. It's a whole new world with Wind Fury, guys. It's fucking crazy. Bet it's top damage, yeah. It always competes with Chain Harvest now. Like, before you get the legendary, like, it doesn't even, it's not even close to Chain Harvest. After you get the legendary, it's always just your top. If, like, next to Chain Harvest, if not above Chain Harvest and damage wise. I guess we'll use Wind Fury just to show off the damage. Damn. Really use Sacrifice, huh? Oh. My Wind Fury didn't even work there. It all worked for me, though. Please give me another proc. There we are. Now we go on the Death Knight, or at least slow him. Go on the healer here. As I get my characters more geared, too, I'm like, I can see why they, like... If you're undergeared, I can see why a lot of people don't like the game, because undergeared people just get, like, kind of one-shot, honestly. But once you do get gear, like, the damage difference... I don't know, it's pretty worth it. Pretty worth it actually focusing on one character. Coming from the guy that has always played many, many characters. Not too bad. Please fix Wind Fury. That is the most annoying shit, especially in Arena 2. Like, I'll be like, oh, I lost the game. Let's see why. Oh, it's because I didn't apply Wind Fury. I just didn't apply a buff. Like, the same thing with Rogue Poisons, too, but... Anyway. Thanks. Like, comment, subscribe, description, bell thing, Twitch, Twitter. All of those things. Till next time. Take it easy, guys.